but the club's board felt more disappointed about the Tommy Robinson chance at the away end at the Hawthorns. Luton's chief executive officer, Gary Sweet posted a personal article on the club's website this morning addressing chants that came from the Luton fans in support of the far-right agitator. As I came away from a magnificent performance at the Hawthorns last night against a very strong West Brom team, as usual, I reflect upon the highs and lows, and the good and can-do-better aspects of both the match and the experience, he reflected. Apart from the result, our experience was blemished, for the second away game running, by hearing the chanting the name of a political figure had by a small number of Hatter supporters. This hugely disappointing for us, as a board, because the individual in question wasn't playing or involved in the squad or staff, Sweet continued, everyone at the club has worked extremely hard and will continue to work tirelessly to create an environment, whether that be Kenilworth Road, Power Court or any away game, for our community of supporters to support their team and enjoy a football match knowing that all prejudice, whether that be political, religious, cultural or racial, can and should be left for another day. This allows us to invite anybody into our environment without discomfort, disrespect or fear, and welcome any and every member of our wide community respectfully. The chairman explained that the club absolutely accept and respect the fact that everyone holds their own independent opinions and values but requested that to temporarily overlook those views for a couple of hours or so when attending Luton Town matches in future. Robinson has been the subject of widespread far-right populist protests after he was jailed for perverting the course of justice earlier this year, a sentence that was later overturned by the Court of Appeal. Share article